What is up guys and welcome back to the channel. So today I'm going to be going over a theory I have about how the Flash and the Reverse Flash could potentially be connected. But before we get started, make sure you guys like, share, subscribe, turn on notifications, and comment down below any other video ideas you might have for me. Now in the comics, Reverse Flash and the Flash absolutely hate each other, but they need each other to live for themselves to live, which means that they cannot kill each other. So the reason that they are connected in the comics is because of their speed forces. As long as their speed forces are functional, one of them cannot kill the other. Anyways, I think it's possible that they might be trying to bring this onto the show in future seasons. Reason being, after season one, I realized that the Flash and Reverse Flash had many chances to kill each other, but they never have. But maybe that's just because they are literally equally matched. I mean, Thawne did say in season one, neither one of us were strong enough to defeat the other. Anyways, maybe this is where they say, you're lucky that you never killed them. So like, they could be talking to Barry saying, it's lu you're lucky you never killed Thawne, or Thawne saying, it's luck you're lucky you never killed Barry. Um, because maybe if they killed one another, then they would also die. Something like that. They could say that in season eight, season seven, something like that. So going over to the original timeline Flash and Reverse Flash, what if in the original timeline where Barry doesn't become the Flash until 2020, Thawn realizes that he can't kill the Flash without killing himself. So he finds some sort of loophole where killing Barry as a child wouldn't kill Thawn in the future. So Thawn goes back in time to accomplish that goal, however Barry follows him back and Barry's mother is murdered and that is how the Flash season 1 starts. Now. I don't know why Thawne wouldn't just tell Barry that that was, why, that was what happened um, in Season 1, but they probably weren't thinking about doing this type of storyline all the way back then, so that is probably why I think that uh, they might be able to just bring it up in the future, like Season 8, something like that. Um, or even maybe in later in Season 7, when Thawne returns, hopefully he will return in Season 7, pretty sure he will. Um, so yeah, hopefully they do something, something along the lines of this, maybe they will say that um, the Flash and Reverse Flash are connected somehow. I think that that would be a really good final season type of thing because, you know, that's like just basically Flash and Reverse Flash and if they end up doing the Flash versus Reverse Flash for the whole season of season 10 or however the last season, whatever season that may be, season 9, season 10, um, I think that doing something like this would definitely work very well. The Flash is also running out of ways to, you know, bring Thawne onto the show in general. Uh, and I feel like using a storyline like this would not only bring him in great, but it would be amazing to see them do a comic book storyline like this on the show. Um, you know, they've been doing a bunch of new stuff on the show, like newer comic book storyline stuff, like Godspeed and Bloodwork. Um, but I think it'd be cool if they, like, brought in some other stuff, like maybe, like, a bunch of more, like, OG stuff, like Grodd, Captain Cold, a bunch of those, like, the rogues. I feel like if they did more of that stuff, then I would like this show a lot better. But it's still an amazing show, obviously. So, I think it'd be really cool if they did something like this, some type of comic book storyline similar to this on the show with The Flash and Reverse Flash. But yeah, so that's about it, guys. Thanks for watching. Make sure to comment your own theories down below, as well as your thoughts on this theory. And I'll see you guys in the next video.